So what are you doing today, Dave? Oh, I'm just uh, taking my shark for a walk. There's the high tide mark. And there's our gear. We gotta go find a camping spot here. There's a, one of those venomous sea crates. Yep, this is the perfect place to camp. Here's another beautiful sea crate. And I'm gonna put my tent right there. Sea crate, my tent there. Sea crate, my tent, sea crate. Any questions? Well, this sucks. Oh, it just sucks. Oh, looks like I'm gonna have to go wash off in the ocean. Maybe I'll get to see a shark. Oh, shark! Black reef tip. There's another one right there. Oh, so very cool. Look at this shark coming up, guys. Whoa, 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 he's coming right for us. <laughs> Look at that. Black tip reef sharks. Look at that beautiful thing. Woo! So what are you doing today, Dave? Oh, I'm just uh, taking my shark for a walk. So we've come to this island because we have read the literature about this island and there's three species of lizards that are here. And those were found on an expedition that only lasted two or three hours. So nobody has looked for lizards on this island at night before and we're gonna be the first ones to do that. So right now, I am going to take my drone and I'm gonna fly it around. I'm gonna look for suitable places on the island that we can go looking for those lizards tonight. So right now it's the middle of the night and <laughs> there's these birds and they're called mullets or they're called, uh, I'm too tired to remember the name of them, petrels. And they're nocturnal and they keep running across the ground here and crashing into me as I'm laying here in my bedroll. And then one of them just woke me up by pecking me in the back of the head. <sighs> my head is not a coconut. Walking, walking and rolling. And then we have a crab eating my sandal. Are you kidding me? All right, well, good night, little buddy. I'm going back to bed. Well, good morning, guys. So I got some pretty decent sleep, actually, considering the mullets pecking my head all night. But, so the chief and his family have come to this island to get us a little bit earlier. They're gonna do a little fishing here, so I'm gonna check out what they're catching in the ocean here. I don't I don't recognize these fish, but then again, I'm not an icky ologist. Up the zone. Yeah, he's caught a few of them. Hey, you and you know what kind of fish these are? Red hind. What are they? Red hind. Red hind. 
think they call them cutthroats as well. Cutthroats and red hinds. Yeah, normally they've just got a, a red red mark around there. I gotcha. Uh huh. speak French pretty much at all. We, oui, s'il vous plaît, amelette du fromage. But the chief, he doesn't speak any English either. And in our entire time together, you know, Milena speaks French and Ewan speaks a little French. So we've been getting along, but between me and the chief, it's a lot of hand sign language and random grunting and a lot of laughing actually. Doesn't matter where you're from, if you're from Chicago or South Africa or Israel or the Canuck tribe here in New Caledonia, people are exactly the same no matter where in the world you go. All right, Chief has coconuts. Merci. Hey, bon. Que bon manger. Merci beaucoup. Uh -huh. Yeah. All right. This is the chief's wife here, and that's the chef chief. Man, the coconut here is so good. I'm starting to really like coconut, actually. Yeah, I am. All right, so we're back on the boat. That's the end of our highland hopping adventure. We're heading back to the main island now. Hey, we almost forgot about you guys. <laughs> All right. Bonjour. <laughs> so shy. Ah, oui, merci, merci. Merci, merci, merci. Demain matin, à 8 h c'est bon? 8 h c'est bien. 8 heures? Oui. Bon, un café? Ok. Merci beaucoup. Ok. Merci, Hélène. Okay. Merci, Gonzou, chef. Et moi qui vous remercie. Merci, chef. Merci. C'est moi qui te remercie. Merci beaucoup. Enchanté. Ok. Oui, oui. Enchanté, au revoir. <laughs> Je repars avec les sacs, mon ami. All right, guys. So that was an absolutely incredible day. Going walking with sharks, they were just pacing me, and they had absolutely no ill will. I felt no fear with those sharks any more than I did with the most venomous snakes in the world. They, like snakes, are so misunderstood and so misrepresented in, you know, cultures around the world. So anyway, we are on Isle of Pines again. We have two days here, so the adventure continues here from the Isle of Pines. Until then, love the planet, keep your life in balance, and rattle on. <laughs>